basically we want to know today, uh, all time, what was your favorite uh, children's show growing up? Was there a show that you loved when, <laughs> yeah. when you were a youngster? What would that be? Um, well, mine was a little known show that I found out was a Canadian cartoon. Uh, called Cadillacs and Dinosaurs. It really existed. It's real. I never heard of it. I never heard of it either. I know, but when you look it up, it's there. Look it up. Yeah, okay. I would recommend looking it up on YouTube because it's, it's as good as I remembered. Cadillacs, so it's Was literally it one a... One season? One season, yeah. And explain what it's about. Uh, the title really says it all. A uh, ca- uh, uh, dystopian future <laughs> right? where uh, yeah. Cadillacs have somehow survived and dinosaurs, and dinosaurs have come back. Wow. Um, and it's sort of one of those, like... Late '80s, early '90s environmentalism, environmentalist right. kind of kids right. shows, like Captain, Planet. like Captain Planet or something. But you see, if the dinosaurs are still around, there's no fossil fuel to put in the Cadillacs. It's the show. That you're just pulling I mean, the tiny thread of a questions. problematic universe in general. Yeah, it's uh, right. the show probably doesn't make sense on any level. Did, did it have a theme song? Oh, I had the best theme song. Yeah. Yeah. Do you, do you remember it? I can't remember it, but we, we did look it up. We did look on, it up. On YouTube. It sort of explains the story. Yeah. That I don't, I don't remember it, but yeah. you should go to the interwebs, yeah. and then they will tell you. The interwebby. Okay. Yeah. I'll go there next. Now, you, do you have a favorite children's well, show? I wasn't really... I didn't have TV. We had a black and white TV, and we had one channel, the CBC. <laughs> so all I watched was Mr. Dress Up. Right. It's all I really remember. And then I got older, and then I remember well, I was in the hospital for a while, and I watched Transformers a lot in the hospital. Was that a transformative experience? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it passed the time, right. which was helpful as a child in a hospital bed. Yes. You, 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 so you had one set, and you watched one channel. You were probably too busy making children's shows uh, at the, the when time. When I was a child? Yeah. No, I, I like to put it on plays, though. <laughs> make my sister perform. It was fun. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's cool. But yeah, Mr. Dress Up was a big one for me. For a lot of Canadians, for sure. And and uh, is there uh, any theme song at any time? What would be your favorite all-time theme song on a TV show? I mean, okay, again, I didn't watch a lot of TV right. when I was younger, but Star Trek The Next Generation, and I can't do it. I was going to do it, but I can't do it, so I'm not going to do it. And there are no words to that, is there? No, it's, not, no, yeah. it's all music. Right. So you're off the hook. Sure Peter, what? Peter? Um, uh, probably, probably The Wire, because it oh. was the same song, but evolved every season. There was a different cover of it every right. season, which I, which I loved. <gasps> Successions. Oh, it's so good. The Succession theme song. Everybody is, is saying Succession yeah. is their favorite theme song. Yeah, it's a great, uh, I mean, it's a great yeah. theme song. It's a great show. It's a great yeah. show. What was it about the theme song that just grabs you? To, to me, with it, without, it's... It, it, Initiates you into the world mm-hmm. of the show so perfectly mm-hmm. that I just think it's 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 like few few theme songs can do that. So wow, for me. there you go. Well, speaking of success, congratulations, Bird of Truth, season three, coming up in January on CBC.